Welcome to Grayon Map. We are asked to solve this problem. We have a trapezoid A, B, C, D, and a line is drawn from point A to the intersection of this uh, trapezoid and circle segment uh, at C. And we form a line X uh, uh, that is also A, E. And the length of D is 2, and C e is 3, and A, B is 6. And we are required to find the length of uh, X or AE. Okay. okay, so since this is a cyclic quadrilateral because this yellow quadrilateral is inside this uh, uh, circle, so this uh, angle at A is 90. Okay, this angle at A. And next is we can actually draw a line from this uh, point B. And this at uh, point A until it they will be perpendicular. So they're perpendicular. Okay, so next is uh, we draw a line from this uh, point A perpendicular to segment uh, uh, BC. So this is perpendicular. And this is a this we form a right triangle. So uh, we find this length. So this length is actually a. This is this should be five, because this is below two plus three. So six square uh, minus uh, five square. Let's call this as e i f b f. So BF, so BF is equal to 30, square to 36 minus 25, so BF is equal to square root of 11. Okay, so now that we have found the length of BF, uh, we can use actually a similarity of triangle. So uh, this triangle. Uh, this triangle is actually similar with this because if this is a alpha and this is a, a beta, this is alpha. I mean alpha, and this is beta because it is ninety. Alpha plus beta should be ninety. So this is alpha, and this is a beta. So these two triangles are similar. So we can use uh, with respect to beta. With respect to beta, that is uh, with respect to beta. Uh, we can actually uh, use uh, hypotenuse. Hypotenuse over adjacent. So, for triang this triangle, the bigger right triangle, hypotenuse is equal to 6 over this adjacent is square root of 11. So, this is also square root of 11. And for this uh, smaller right triangle, this is the unknown. Hypotenuse is uh, uh, x, this length x. So, x all over... Uh, this length, this length to the adjacent to beta. <coughs> so two. <coughs> so we just simply cross multiply. So we have x is equal to twelve over a square root of eleven. Or if and if we uh, rationalize, so x is equal to twelve square root of eleven over uh, eleven. Uh, units and that is our answer so thank you for watching until the end of the video please like the video if you like our solution and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so you'll be updated for more math videos like this thank you bye